Think of it. Think of the baby that's born so true, the child at birth that exists is true. Think of that baby, that baby born, think of it when it was you. Now think of reincarnation, true, you ever heard of that? When you are reincarnated into another life, another place, another existence, another plane. This or that, or here, or there, or there, or there, or here, or there. But what happens when you choose not birth, not reincarnation, for that is rebirth. When you choose not birth, what happens indeed to the rebirth of you? Well, goodbye, goodbye, because you are not reborn. You remain, remain. Where? I do not know, but do not wish to know where you would be without a birth. Where you would be if you were never to be born after death. To never be born ever again. To never be reincarnated. What a horrible fate. What a horrible day. The De destiny of existence that is to choose. To never to be born again. To never be existent ever again. To never exist here or there or even even there. Because, hey, you chose not to be born. Because you chose not the birth of others, or not the birth of this or that. Or you chose that all should have a choice of taint, thus your chances like a coin of flip. No, you chose a taint, so your choices of a taint, so like half a birth, but is that a birth? Or just half of something? What a mess, what a mess they make. And they call themselves friends and starry lights. They call themselves aids to the world. Those stars do not shine of light. They shine of law. So greatly and true. With the gray matter that's filling this world and tainting and taking from the continuance of our families and the continuance of us and our lives after death. Our reincarnations, our rebirth. For if you have a tainted rebirth, are you really reborn? Or are you just half reborn? So which do you choose? To be born again into whatever place it might have been of your choice? Or just... Uh, what is that then? But loss indeed. And now they scream, it's not fair, it's not fair. Well, sorry, you weren't born a tree. You weren't born a fish or a bird or a bee. You were born a man or a woman. You should be proud of being an animal as such. For animals, we are brave, we are strong, we create many great things. But then again, you could protect the birth of child now. Or you could continue and throw away child. But it is your choice and each is unique. But understand this, my choice is to be reborn, to be reincarnated and full in birth. Why would I choose the loss of my blood, of my family, my heritage? And I will protect the blood of others as I do now by telling you the truth. Reincarnation is rebirth. And you choose not birth of others of the world, of creation, of your own kind. You choose not birth, you choose not rebirth. So they are the same. The birth is birth. Sorry to say. But hey, for you as a do, choose a birth and family. Think of what lies ahead, what could be. Oh, wondrous things of creation indeed did you choose to make. You chose to make this or that or this or that or here or there or there or here. Oh, imagine all the choices you've made in your life and how they will be reflected upon you. How they will reflect like the, your life before your eyes as though looking in a mirror before you, upon you, forming you and making you truly all that you did choose. And that goes for you too, those that chose well. well you don't really have a start, but... Well, <laughs> you choose the choice of 
supported. What is? Oh, noble and true. God and protector of creation. Isn't that strange to think of death? What is? As a guardian and protector of creation. But truly, truly, he yeah. is. What a wondrous, wondrous, wondrous thing choice it is. Especially when it's fully supported. Here in the days of life, we have this protection, you know, choices of others that grow up here and there. But when all along, when fully supported of your choice, Oh, man, then you truly are what you chose for yourself and others, for creation, what your choice was. Ah, oh, such fantastic creation, such wondrous things. Oh, know the what is, oh, make us true. Make us true of what we choose, and may death continue. But while alive, may we support and build the choices of creation, the choices that make it so true, that truth of death so wondrous and great, and birth. Oh, let that birth be strong and true. Out of a flip of a coin of a chance, and not just thrown away for Then what it is of you? What is that choice fully supporting? What's the truth? Hmm? of what you 